So for during your stay at Hazley, you've got uh, available for you to use um, a Bosch double oven. And this is a short explainer video just to explain how to use it and operate it. So the first thing to do when you want to use the oven is just to check that it's switched on at the mains. And there's a switch here to the right, so just make sure that that's uh, switched on and lit up. And as long as it is, then you can start using the oven. The first thing to explain is uh, the control panels and you've got two different control panels here. So the control panel on your left controls the main oven which is the bottom oven and the control panel on your right controls the top oven um, which is essentially a very basic oven function and a grill. So the one you'll use most of the time is this control panel to the left. So um, the button on the left here you'll just have to depress that button in order to select a function. The first function here is a fast preheat function. So if you're in a real rush and you want to get your food on and cooking very, very quickly and you can't bother to wait for it to preheat, you can use that function to, to heat, it, heat it up very quickly. The second function is the fan oven setting and this is the one that you'll use for most of your everyday cooking. The third function is this one here and this one is called a gentle fan. Now, this one is can be used without preheating the oven at all, so you can just put that straight on and put your dinner straight in the oven. Um, what you typically use that for is if, for example, you've got something like, maybe for example, a sausage roll, that, and it says on the packet, cooked and ready to eat, but you fancy it a bit warm, and you just want to shove it into the oven for a few minutes just to warm it up, you can use that function and, and put it in straight away and, and leave it for however long you, you, you desire. The next function is the grill function. Um, this is a large grill area. You would use this if, for example, you wanted to uh, cook some sausages and bacon or, or maybe do some toast um, and you're, you're doing rather a lot of it, then you can use the large grill function. This one here is a grill with a fan, so it circulates the air, and you'd use that if you were roasting poultry or meat or fish. The last function is just a normal oven without a fan. And this is a great function to use if, for example, you want to do some baking. And the last function here doesn't operate the oven at all. This is just a light for the oven. So all it does is it lights up the oven. Um, so, for example, if you wanted to give it a clean and you just want to see what you're doing, you can just put the light on. So select what, whatever function you want to use. Let's say, for example, you want the fan oven function. That's what the one that you'll use most of the time. The next thing you'll need to do is to select the temperature. So if you depress the button and then take it up to whatever temperature um, is required. Um, so that's, um, that's the first control panel. You'll notice that as soon as I've um, operated it and, and selected to the, it to the right temperature, you'll notice this little light comes on here. That's just a light that tells you that the oven is currently preheating and it's not preheated until that light goes out. So um, that's the uh, main oven function and how to operate it. If you wanted to use the top oven, then there are a few functions available for you here as well. They're similar to the other ones. So this one is the normal oven function without a fan. This one here is just a small grill area. So if maybe you're cooking for one or perhaps two and you just need a small grill area, you can use that for some bacon and sausages or some toast or whatever. Uh, this is a larger grill area. And then again, if you just wanted a light and nothing else, then the oven, top oven can be lit up so that you can get in there to clean it or whatever you need to do. So once you've selected the function that you want, let's say you want the oven, then again, you just depress this one here and select the right temperature. Again, you'll notice as soon as I did that, the light comes on and that's again an indicator showing you that the oven is currently preheating. So let's say that you put your things in the oven and you want to time it. The thing to do then is to go to the central panel and you'll see there's a little clock symbol just underneath here. Now it's just a, a very simple tap. So you can just tap that there and then you can press the plus button until it gets up to the amount of time that you want. If you, can, uh, if you want to press and hold, it will go up very, very quickly indeed. Um, so you can get to your desired amount of time um, quickly and then you just leave that and it will, it will then start to count down. Uh, and obviously it will, it will bleep when, um, when that time has expired. So that expi explains how to use the event.